In some local communities, the relationship between people and their police departments can be tense. And that is true at times for a community within Brooklyn Park. Ellery McArdle shows us the effort to strengthen that relationship in the middle of a busy intersection. It's the community is the police and the police is the community. We are not different. And that's the main message on this corner, unity. People have been more united, people have been more integrated, people have been more, uh, I would say, friendly. But there's always room for a stronger relationship between the people who live in Brooklyn Park and its police officers. So this is how this community is trying to make progress, by talking. It's about communication and keeping that open lines of communication open. Yeah, and there's a reason why police chose to have the event at this intersection of Yates Avenue and Brookdale Drive because they're called here a lot. They've recorded at least 144 police calls here just this year. People are talking about their concerns. We losing our babies. That's why I go. And they're writing down questions for Police Chief Craig Envilson, who's on the microphone answering them. Go back to your apartment building, grab some people, and bring them on, just so we can have this conversation and start to build build the trust. Transparency, open food, fun for the kids, and frank conversation. This is huge, and we're looking to duplicate it. And sooner or later, we'll build a better home, we'll build a better school, we'll build better communities, and hopefully we can build a better country. Ellery McArdle, CARE 11 News, Brooklyn Park. Numbers on Brooklyn Park's website show that crime has steadily gone down in the past five years, from 7,000 in 2014 to 6,500 last year.